This is the Salt Lake City Police Headquarters, and behind these walls, every hour that passes in this urgent investigation, the situation becomes more dire. The latest this morning, police tell Fox News that the owner of a home not far from here has been identified as a person of interest. Crime scene tape is still blocking the alleyway behind that house right now. Police are not publicly naming this person of interest, but his name and his background is readily known to a lot of people around here, including his neighbors. Investigators and detectives executed a warrant on the home and removed all types of evidence. Aerial video even shows investigators digging in the backyard. The medical examiner was there. Police are also intensely focused on finding a mattress that this person of interest apparently gave away online. The big question is, what type of evidence might that mattress hold? The theory here is that missing Mackenzie Lewick might have ended up at this house or someone related to her disappearance did. The owner of the home, the person of interest, runs a very active, busy Airbnb. People say that there's always people coming and going from this house. I have people. never seen anything out of the ordinary happen nor hear about it. Uh, I know he stays busy with his rental because it's a pretty decent uh, room. I've seen it. And he stays busy with his rentals. So far, missing Mackenzie Lewick's cell phone has not been recovered. Rather eerie, her Instagram account suddenly showed activity less than 48 hours ago. Her account started following another one. And as we see so often in these cases nowadays, a missing person's digital footprint becomes so critical.